Hello, my name is Russell Toll. In the late 1990s, I discovered an infinite class of new polyhedra, which I named the rhombic spiralohedra. This movie provides the merest sketch of these curious solids. Spiralohedra have K arms, or ridges, which follow helical paths from one pole to another. When K equals 3 or K equals 4, rhombic spiralohedra close pack to fill space, after the manner of cubes or rhombic dodecahedra, respectively. Here we will see only three-armed spiralohedra. They may be constructed with thousands or millions of faces, and yet still they close pack to fill space. Here we'll see a slightly simpler three-armed spiralohedron. Moreover, the limiting cases, when the number of rhombic faces becomes infinite, as it were, form examples of what are called ruled surfaces. I discovered these spiralohedra while investigating the dissection of polar zonohedra into rhombic hexahedra. Using the software Mathematica, I was able to create only those hexahedra which formed parts of the exterior of the polar zonohedra. And by looking inside these hollow shells of rhombic hexahedra, I discerned a series of spiraling valleys. It only remained to devise an algorithm giving the shape which would fill those valleys. Again, Mathematica provided an environment in which it was easy to translate my newfound spiralohedra into various positions. It was not long before the seemingly impossible became all too true. Three and four-armed spiralohedra close pack to fill space. There are yet other ways these forms can be fitted together. Here is an example of 27 three-armed spiralohedra close packing to fill a region of space. I also experimented with making plain sections of space fillings of spiralohedra, and it often seemed good to explode them apart slightly. We'll see an example of that in a little while. Here we see an array of three-armed spiralohedra into which hollows exist in which we could fit six-armed spiralohedra. And here is an example of a close packing of three-armed spiralohedra to fill a small region of space and a plain section was taken of the various spiralohedra. It's interesting to see how the section involves triangles of different sizes. Such is a brief glance at a new and infinite set of space-filling, non-convex, chiral, rhombic polyhedra.